Welcome to How To Tuesday. Today we're going to learn about the new 856T 70mm stack lights that are a brighter and more energy efficient signaling solution. Hi, I am Trevor Jones with Royal Industrial Solutions, part of the Industrial Solutions Network, and today we're going to talk about the new 856T 70mm stack lights. So the new 856T stack lights offer a modular design that allows multiple units to be stacked right on top of each other very easily. These models will be taking over for the 855Ts. They are only offered in an LED solution but they are far brighter than the 855Ts and they are more energy efficient. They come in just a standard steady and they can come in a multi so this top one here with the use of dip switches found inside the unit we can actually modify the different types of modes so if I want to do a steady there or if I want to do say a flashing of sorts I can go modify my dip switch and now I've got say my flashing here. This model actually comes with one steady and three different flashing modes. Many of our models are going to be offered with that spec. One of the other unique modules we'll be offering is the clear uh, LED which is actually a multicolored unit. This includes seven unique colors and of the seven you can use the three. You can use three circuits. So 856Ts are a modular circuit design where you can do seven circuits tall. The standard steady unit is only one circuit. The multi-LED is three. So if you want to do the multi-LED with, say, a top-mounted sounder, you can do just these two units here. You can get three of your colors if you want to do just a red, amber, and green, and your sounding unit at the top. The top sounding unit can be programmed with up to 48 unique sounds and the inline sounder module can be programmed with up to eight different unique sounds. In addition to these, we also have the top mounted beacon units which can be mounted directly on the very top and these are much like a strobe unit. Also included with these, we have different mounting types for the bases including a base that mounts to the 855 mounting and will then power the rest of your 856T units. Do be aware that the 856 modules will not work in line with the 855. You can do an 856 base and all the way up on 856s or you can do the uh, 855T mounting base which will work with the 856s across the board. There's a specific power supply that will work for those. Otherwise, it has to be the 856. And that's everything on the 856Ds.